Today we're going to do a really quick proof that shows that ATM is not mapping reducible to ETM. So you, you may think, well, we have the mapping reduction to the complement of ETM. That's pretty easy to do. But it turns out that there is no mapping reduction to the original problem, non-complemented version. And it's a very quick proof. So the idea is to note that if we have some language A, which mapping reduces to B, then this is the same thing as saying that the complement of A mapping reduces to the complement of B. And the reason for that is for mapping reductions, the function that takes some input x over here is going to produce some f of x over here. And x is in A if and only if f of x is in B. So if x is not in A, then f of x is not in B. So the strings that are not in A need to result in something that is not in B, which is exactly what this is saying. So here we can actually rephrase this in a slightly different way. We can rephrase it as ATM complement mapping reducible to ATM complement. And I claim that that's not possible. And the reason is that we know from what we have proven in other videos that this thing is not recognizable. And this thing over here is recognizable. And why is the thing on the right recognizable? Well, we can just start trying strings for a certain number of steps each time and keep increasing that limit. And if it ever accepts something at some point, then we will say, yeah, we have non-empty language, and then therefore we could say accept here. And so we don't have to run forever necessarily for, uh, so, so therefore we get a recognizer for the complement of ATM, and we don't have one because we proved it for ATM complement. Why does this, why is this impossible to occur? There's no mapping reduction like this. It's because uh, if this was, uh, if there was such a reduction, then I could take some input over here and then run it through the recognizer over here. Then the recognizer will, should, because of the mapping reduction, will give the same answer to over here, which would imply a recognizer over here. And we know it's not recognizable. So therefore, there's no mapping reduction from ATM to ETM. Hopefully that was interesting. Leave comments about mapping reductions down into the comments down below. As always, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. It really helps us out. There are many other links in the video description if you want to support the channel further. And as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.